certainly here at the American Pastors Network and Stand in the Gap, we emphasize the importance of the pulpit and the preaching of the Word of God as being, without a doubt, the greatest option for restoring this nation and the families of this nation back to the Lord. But let's look at men and their important responsibility. When you study the Scriptures, you find that God has given a great responsibility to men to be the leaders in the home, to be the leaders in the church, to be the leaders as it relates to good, sound, moral, and biblical character and doctrine. Let's take a look at our nation, and we know that we've got an issue here today. My question is, what is going to take place in America if we don't really see our men becoming the biblical-minded men God would have them to be? That's a very good question. I think God's Word points out that when men understand their proper function— he blesses their activities. And it starts with internally with us as men. When we get right with God and we have an intimate relationship with Jesus Christ, that means, you know, rejoicing always, praying without ceasing, and, and being thankful in all things. It, it changes our focus, and we begin to minister to our wives and our families differently. And then it changes the family, which then changes the church, which then changes the community. And eventually, the culture begins to look toward God instead of toward themselves. And so it really, it has to be a movement, and it has to be a revival that ends up with people recognizing their true source of life and goodness, and, and that's God, God Almighty, through His Son, Jesus Christ. 